hi guys in this video i will let you know how you can use neighbor maps if you are in korea and you want to do anything if you want to know around your surroundings like you want to go for cafe you want to go for hospital or you want to travel to another city or another place so the korean search engine which is called neighbor the neighbor map is same like google map so this is the best i think so if you are living in korea or if you want to use if you want to found something if you want to search in korea so first of all maybe whenever you install your neighbor map application maybe it would be in korean so uh, i already made a video like how you can how you can use neighbor maps in english how you can change the language of your neighbor maps uh, uh, neighbor maps application so i just want to remind like if right now if your uh, neighbor map application language is korean so neighbor map application allow us that we can use this application in four different languages because this is korean uh, search engine so by default language is korean but we can change this to another languages like japanese chinese or english so this is not the video about like how you can con how you can change the language of your neighbor application so but if uh, right now if you want don't want to see another video, Video. so i just want to do uh, a recap like how you can change your english uh, application change your language in this application so you can see there are three bars on the top left corner so you just need to press on it if you are if your application is right now in the korean so you can change your language so you just need to click on the top the three bars which are on your top left so you just need to go in the last option which is called setting right now my application is in english so you can see but if your application is in korean then you can just press the last option which is setting so after clicking the setting so you can go to the fifth option from down first second third fourth and fifth which is called language <coughs> setting so you just need to click on it and then you can see there are four different languages you just need to choose the whatever language which you want to use for your neighbor map application so this was just a recap like how you can use this application in english so the the my purpose of this video like uh, to teach you how you can use neighbor map application so whenever you change your application or you change the language of your application so you can see there are a lot of other options which you can you which uh, you can do on the neighbor application first of all i will let you know the pop up you can see there there you can see there are by default some options like you can you can if you want if you are hungry and you are looking for some food so there are multiple options like korean japanese chinese western asian fast food pizza anything like that right now if if i i want if i am looking for some fried chicken so i just need to click on the fried chicken and it will show the nearest uh, nearest positions around me related to fried chicken so other than that like if i want to go for some cafe or i want to i am looking for some bank or atms or living hospital hospital entertainment or cinemas or parking stations or anything like that so i can choose i can choose like anyone from uh, uh, anyone from the from these options like i want to go to any cafe so you can see it will show the nearest cafe around you and you can go to that cafe by following this neighbor map application so uh, th these are the by default option which you can use uh, other than that if you are new in this area and you want to do you want to go to another place like there is a, a there is a place which is called itewan for example i want to go to itewan so i just need to write here itewan so like wh what is the nearest application what is the nearest and simplest way like how i can go to itewan so you just this is the itewan so you just need to click on it and you just need to choose your current location so it will show you the all possible options like how you can go to itewan so i just press i just choose the option which is the subway option so you can see there are multiple options like i can go by the subway as well i can go by bus as well i can go by taxi i can go by walk by cycle as well so the minimum the time which is required on the subway that is the 41 minute so it will guide you like you can you have to choose line 5 and you need to transfer to line 6 and then you can go to uh, then you can move you can uh, go to itewan area so this is the best application if you are living in south korea i think so and guys uh, if 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 you found this video helpful so please like our video and if you did not subscribe our channel so please subscribe our channel as well so thanks for watching have a good day